Okay, at this point, it's probably a good idea to have some sort of a review. So let's have some sort of a review. The um, light is created from a point source in a diverging manner. Diverging light has minus vergence, so all light is created in the world with a negative sign in front of it mathematically, which is a drag. Okay, so the farther we get from a point source of light, the tighter the angle between the light rays or the smaller the vergence. So we get this inverse relationship as distance from a point source goes up, vergence of the light from that point source goes down. Inverse relationship. So drag number one, light is created with a minus sign. Drag number two, there's an inverse relationship between distance and vergence. Oh, that should be a C, not an S. And then there's a mathematical relationship between the distance and the vergence. So if the distance of this red one is one-tenth of a meter, the vergence equals minus 10 diopters because one over distance equals vergence. If over here we are, uh, let's say two meters equals minus one half of a diopter. And if let's say the green one is infinity, one over infinity approaches zero. So the vergence equals zero diopters and the light rays are essentially parallel. So if we stand near a point source of light, the light reaches us in a diverging manner. And if we stand an infinite distance away or practically 20 feet away, then that light reaches us parallel with zero vergence and nowhere in nature do we get presented with converging light. The only way to get converging light is if we pass it through a plus lens or if we bounce it off of a concave mirror. And that is our review. Thank you very much.